A very special on a positive note tonight. A story that aired on KDKA led to a reunion between a local woman and her pet. Kim Gable shows us it's a happy ending. Three years in the making. I love it. We first met Genevieve Woods in 2018, a different kind of social influencer who sends out delightful care packages to lift the spirits of her followers. Everyone calls her Peach, and her presence is all about positivity. Hi guys, it's Peach. Peach has a rare and debilitating form of mitochondrial disease, similar to ALS. She has emotional support animals that she adores, but her family hoped she could also benefit from a specific kind of service animal called a stability dog. As a mother of a disabled daughter, it's like, when she leaves this house, it's like, ugh, like I worry about it a lot. They're specially trained for weight bearing. It's a tedious and expensive process. And that's where this story started. I had put the story to bed whenever this had happened three years ago. An anonymous donor gave $5,000 for training, and a woman named Shirley Bills gave Peach an Airedale named Amara. God teaches us to do the right things. We need to do the right thing. So I said to Frank, I said, you know what, Miss Amara needs to go help this girl. A sweet companion, but not a physical fit for Peach. But instead of Amara being returned to Shirley, the trainer allegedly kept Amara, claiming she was contractually his now. We won't go into the allegations for legal reasons, but eventually he and Amara disappeared. An emotional ordeal that got a lot of attention on KDKA. Now fast forward to this fall. And then I got a message from this random person who had been watching the story, who had been, who live in the area. And then she sent me a screenshot. This dog is at Animal Protection. That's right, three years later, Amara ends up at Animal Protection in New Kensington. The staff there watched the story and confirmed it was her. I felt so bad that someone had gifted Genevieve a dog, was so gracious to give a dog in hopes of it to be trained and then to have all this happen. Her missing piece of herself, I'm, I'm glad that she has found it and has come to peace. And I think that it really attributes to the public's, you know, uh, 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 their hearts towards this story and, and really feeling that angst for the owner of this dog and wanting to put that together. When we first met you several years ago, it was because of the segment that you do online called Positive Peach. So this positive story, I mean, just fits so beautifully into your vibe, doesn't it? I'm all about finding positivity where you can. Meanwhile, Peach plans to keep on giving. Positively thankful. And inspiring others with her kindness. This is Kim Gable on a positive note. And Peach works with the nonprofit Mito Action, raising awareness and helping families impacted by her condition. Don't forget, Kim always wants to hear your positive stories. So if you have one, send them on over. Head over to kdka.com slash OPN.